when you're on inpatient, you have to be at the hospital at 5 a.m. Waking up at 4 a.m. can definitely be a struggle. So sometimes you do want to hit the snooze button, but you just kind of have to get up and kind of get started on your day because you don't want to be late. You want to make sure you give a great impression to the preceptor that you're with that day. Third year is very different from first and second year. It feels more now like having a job, being able to wake up in the morning, you go see patients all day, and then you come home. Kind of more traditional kind of job-like. Right now, I'm in the Longitudinal Integrated Clerkship, LIC, and every day is very different. One thing about our curriculum that is very unique and that I really do love about it is over the LIC period, you have this white space built in so you can really follow patients that you build relationships with both in the same specialty or across specialties, which is really nice about the curriculum. You can never be fully prepared for the patient interactions you're gonna have because every patient's very different, every patient's unique and has different kind of conditions that they're dealing with. But the best thing I can say that did prepare me was just to kind of have an open mind and to be okay with being wrong and trying again and being okay with not knowing everything and just being open to learning something new every day. I'll get home typically about five or six depending on the day, which leaves me enough time to go to the gym, have dinner, and then try to study for any upcoming board exams or also prepare for the next day with patients and cases that I might be seeing or also just review different topics that I saw that day and to make sure that I'm kind of reinforcing the information that I'm learning that day from the patients. One of my favorite things about being in Atlantic City is definitely the sunsets. That's one time during the day I try to stop what I'm doing and I try to make my way outside or to a window to try to enjoy the sunset and just appreciate the day. Because third year, you, you're learning a lot, you're interacting with a lot of people, so you have to make sure you keep yourself well to be able to take care of others because it's important to, to stay happy, stay healthy. Usually my roommate and I or some friends will go to the boardwalk, go for a walk, maybe grab a bite to eat, and then we'll come back and get ready for the next day. I'm typically in bed by like 11, 11.30. Third year can definitely be tough, and at the end of the day you can be very tired, very exhausted, but honestly every day I look forward to meeting new patients and learning about them, and. Learning through the patients, I think, is the best part of third year and something that I look forward to every single day. And yeah, that's kind of my day.